the TBA golf tournament is coming up. Awesome. Cool. Or did you all place last year? Oh, we were fifth. A TBA, we were in fifth. Yeah. Fifth. And the first two teams, teams are always cheaters anyway. So right. So technically, <laughs> we came in third. <laughs> Look, you guys know how to work the system this year. I want the trophy. You need well, to no. play, Jeff. We got I don't. I, we wouldn't win anything. If I well, we'll, we'll let <laughs> We'd you be the loudest score, team though. out there, though, I'll tell you that. Yeah, I want the trophy. This is the third year in a row. It's, the, true. it's the trophy. It's the oh, trophy. We're not an expansion team. You got to give us a couple years under our belt, man, and then. We do have the best time out there. No. Oh, yeah. 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 I know. I've heard about the time you all have out there. I'm everybody else, everybody else right praising right God. Right <laughs> early in the morning. <laughs> when they Fire need shotgun start. Hey, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to send start. Michael out there with y'all. I'm going to send Michael. Michael probably did pretty good oh, on yeah. that, too. Might be hanging out by the fireball tent. It would be no good. <laughs> yeah. Okay, how did we do yesterday? <laughs> oh, it turned out really good. The Murphy bed, the office, and it matched their, the, I guess, the tile color and everything that they had in there. Okay. Really matched pretty good. Clown's yep. happy. Yeah, real happy with it. Yep. Claudia yeah. came out? Yeah. Beach, Beach Boys. Boys. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Man, that's as good as it gets. That's as good as it gets. They left my kid. fries out of the bag. But yeah, they left, the, they left the, his fries out, man. He wasn't no good after that upset. either, man. <laughs> pretty upset after yeah. that. Yeah, he had to walk around for a minute, man. Yeah. So, All right, well, you got lunch. Yeah, I got lunch. It was good. Okay, so today, Mike, what do we have? Uh, Casi Mano. It's actually three spaces. It's a pantry, laundry room, and a master closet. Okay. It's another one I need. Actually, is it? Okay. You yeah. taking my twin brother out Now, yeah. from what I hear, yeah, what, from what I hear is I'm taking uh, Nick's stunt double <laughs> on this job with me. Is that correct? Yes, you are. Okay. Yeah. Right, his younger brother. Yeah. Now, is he, is he ready for this he out kind of work? He's a dangerous job. I, don't, I can't hurt you. Right, I right. I can't get hurt. So right. Okay. I sent him out in, in my place. Did you prep him? Did you prep him? In your yeah, state. I state. taught him nothing. <laughs> you taught him nothing. You're on your He's own. not taking so any responsibility. Perfect. Look, if you're okay. not careful, you'll get them mixed up. They look that much alike. Sound alike, mannerisms. It's I crazy. have no doubt that I'm going to be calling him Nick okay, it's at crazy. several sure. points during the day. I, I, so. I did it for a month until I finally figured it out. So. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, cool. Anything else? Mike went to Chambers job from Tamara. She just gave you a 10 and said perfection. Hold on. No smiley face. Hold on, Mike. You got a smiley, smiley face. Smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> smiley face. From, from Tamara. Tamara. Oh, from Tamara. And she, isn't, she just doesn't go dueling them out any. No, no, she doesn't. Enough <laughs> <laughs> said. So, so, said. Yeah. Okay, on that note, we'll end the meeting on that high note, yeah, Michael. No doubt. Everybody. So everybody, oh. work safe. Uh, yeah, don't work Cody too hard today, man. He needs to come to work tomorrow, right? Well, yeah, what you're we saying? need him to come to work tomorrow. Okay. Oh, he's yeah. a workhorse, man. He's a workhorse. Don't worry about that. All right. You we'll find out. People. Just Who's in the pudding. That's we'll right. That's Just right. Keep okay. Picking, man. Knock it out of the park. All right. Hi, I'm Claudia Casamano. My husband and I recently moved to a condo at the beach. We were living in a five bedroom house with a huge yard and we don't want a yard and we don't want all those extra bedrooms. So we started looking for a one level condo and this is where we ended up. We're very happy with the beautiful view of the beach, but not enough storage space here we found out. So we're uh, getting some extra storage. We don't have a laundry closet at all in this condo. So we're going to use a cabinet in the laundry room as our uh, linen closet. We don't have a linen closet. And in the bedroom, our master closet is about two thirds the size of what it was. So I decided to call Closet Factory and talk to Jacinta. She had done a closet for us before at our last house. She did our master bedroom closet and it was phenomenal. She gave us cubbies and shoe racks and uh, drawers and it was great. And even better, we're gonna get a great organized pantry because the pantry was just lay all your stuff on a shelf and you can't see what's in back. So she's gotten us some pull-out drawers where we can 
actually put the things, the spices in and pull them out because my husband and I both cook a lot and we have a huge collection of spices, probably three drawers worth. So now we can pull the drawers out. She even went and measured how tall the tallest jars were so that we could get uh, the space for them and then the shorter drawers, we could put two of cat drawers in and it's gonna be phenomenal. So I can't wait to see that. And, and the master closet, I'm real excited to see how it turns out. We're here today at a, the job for a Cosimono. We, it's a really cool condo job, and so I needed some backup. My number one man wasn't available, so we got the next best thing. We got a cookie cutter replacement, which is Nick's brother, Cody. So he's going to be helping me out today. Just recently started here in December. Liked everything about it so far. Just trying to get some more outside work. You got to fill your brother's shoes? That's hard. Ain't that hard wear the same shoe size. <laughs> I think he's got his boots on right now. All right, so now we're gonna go check out the spaces and uh, we'll get started. I'll go down here to get like the first load and then you just start keep bringing stuff up. You just kind of separate, you know, separate on the rooms. So let's go get this going. The biggest thing about this job is in the pantry, the walls came to a funny angle and we actually had to have these templated and we came back, we sat down with Jeff, we went over all the measurements, uh, put everything on the CNC router, spec'd it out till we actually got it right and then cut the shelves for the pantry because they, without that we would have had to put a panel and they could have lost about a foot of space and we were trying to get them as much space as we could get them because they wanted it to go back in the corner. And the only way to do that was to cut some special shelves that actually almost looked like a stop sign. I got Cody filling in the pantry now. I got it uh, pretty much lined up and it's anchored in. So he's gonna go ahead and start filling that in. I'm gonna move on to the laundry uh, room, get that going. We haven't installed a wand that has been there as long as me. We've, we've come up together in the company. So we have clients that I've had for years. And this one client we went to see, um, she was a new client. And she had four Great Danes. Now, Great Danes are small ponies. Obviously, I'm not tall. I'm vertically challenged. The first time I go to see her, and she's Virginia Beach, and I go around, you have to go around the back of the house, go up through the deck. And all of a sudden, out of the corner of my eye, I see this thing coming across the yard. I'm like, oh my God, <laughs> this great thing just, they like to jump. Just puts his paws right up on my shorts, just licking my face. And I'm like, damn dog, about that time, he really knocks me off bounce. I go on my butt, legs up in the air. Client sees us, oh my, she says, I am so sorry, I'm so sorry, I thought my husband had locked them all up. So, go in the house, do my thing, you know, they wanted to put Murphy beds up in the loft area, two Seco beds. Well, there's a spiral staircase going up to this loft. So I was like, hmm, a Seco bed, the frame comes all in one piece, so it's not gonna bend. 
So I get hold of Juan and said, Juan, can you go look at this job with me? So we go out there. He says, Claudia, what have you done now? And meanwhile, I warned him about the dogs. When Juan and I went out to do the measurements and we were ready to leave, the clients had left and just left us there. So we assumed the dogs were locked up. So we great leave and we're going out the door. Corner lot, we see way down on the lot, the great day. So Juan and I was like, hey, get back in the house real quick. He said, okay, we're gonna have to make a run for it. So here we are opening up the door and hauling butt across the yard to beat the dogs out the gate so that they can't jump on us and knock us down. So I have a thing with dogs, I guess. What more can I say? I got Cody filling in the pantry now. I got it uh, pretty much lined up and it's anchored in. So he's gonna go ahead and start filling that in. I'm gonna move on to the laundry uh, room, get that going. When we were designing this space, it was fun because right in the initial beginning, it only had just one long wire shelf. The washer and dryer initially were stored to the far right corner and they had a wine fridge that was over on the left corner. And we decided to scoot them over so that we could utilize the space to the right of the wash, washer and dryer to place a tall cabinet, which you'll see here. Then we've got some sus suspended cabinets here, right above the washer and dryer for additional storage. And then lastly, um, what we did in here is I recommended a cleat um, that has these beautiful brushed nickel um, coat hooks um, that are wonderful. And so we've designed those and those will be installed today. Now I'm in the master closet. So we got the pantry, it's pretty much uh, almost done. We got the laundry done and uh, Cody's filling that one in. And I'm gonna start with this. So hopefully, you know, we'll get this done, knocked out pretty, pretty quickly. Uh, all the measurements checked out so far really good. So we are rolling, I'd like to see that. Gotta finish up the trim. All right, Claudia, let's check out the pantry now that it's wait. all done. Oh, yes, look at all the cabinet awesome. space and the drawers yes. and the different sizes of drawers, the deep ones and the shallow ones. Perfect. Perfect. Perfect so this for is, what we want us to put in there. Yeah, this is such a better use of the space now. Um, and even how the angled shelves worked out and get a peek 
over there at how the angle shelves. Oh, so look. that way we didn't have and to. And then do the just shelves are deeper. Inches. Yes, exactly. They're much deeper, much more space to put the, exactly the supplies that we need to on. There. Right. So we were able to keep it the same depth all the way across versus right. having to go well, back right. to we eleven inches. To, yes. Yep, which was an option, but I think you'll get better, much better use it's of even space more this way. Pullouts than I thought we were going to have. So that's. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Yeah, so all those little tiny items now that were falling in the wire shelves, yeah. you can neatly have them in there. All they wouldn't the hands, even sit all the spices. On the wire exactly. Right. And awesome. pull them out and see exactly what we have. What you've got. Exactly. And not try to guess what's, you know, 16 mm -hmm. inches back. Exactly. That's going to be perfect. I you have to wait. move everything just to get to yes. what's in the back. Perfect. Awesome. Beautiful job. It. Okay, well, let's go check out the laundry room. Oh, great. I can't <laughs> wait to see what that has turned out to be. Here we go. Laundry room. <laughs> laundry room. The multi-purpose room. Yes, it's not just laundry. Yep. It's going to serve so many purposes. Look how exactly. neat and beautiful it is. Awesome. Look how nice the cabinets look. Beautiful. And they match perfectly with what's in my kitchen. Exactly. Too. That was why I was recommending that door style. Right. Now it feels like they were a part of that the house door originally. and the handles too are perfect. Mm -hmm. They match exactly. perfectly. But you have so much more storage now than just the wire shelf that oh, went yeah. across. And it'll be neat, it'll be hidden. hidden. I mean, this is so oh, your new yes. linen closet that you didn't have. Look at all those shelves. Yes, too. so now you have a and place. On the bottom, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. And remember, these are adjustable, so if fish comes to shove and you need more shelves, you can always call and order more. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I didn't think of that. And this is not just one shelf, no. Yeah, two up there, yes. too. Yes. <laughs> All our cleaning supplies, laundry supplies, right can be up there, nice I can and reach neat. the bottom and get those mm -hmm. easily. Yep. Uh, and so nice and neat. Exactly. Rather than before it was total disarray. Right. On the wire shelves yeah, and having to pull stuff around. And, so. and then behind you, your new coat closet. I forgot. <laughs> my new coat closet. <laughs> exactly. So now you've got a place to hang all Look your coats. I'm glad we chose those uh -huh. hooks too. Mm -hmm. I like the nice hooks. Yeah, it really is in keeping with the stainless steel saw throughout right. the house. Right, and I like the design Modern. and the flow of those hooks too. Mm -hmm. I can ha look at how much you can oh. hang up there too. Exactly. You can hang so many coats on that. Yep. Coats, umbrellas, the dog leash. The, the dog leash. Oh, the yes. <laughs> the whole nine. Perfect. Yay. Just what I needed. Awesome. Well, good. Well, now the last one is more? the master closet. One more. Yes. Okay. Let's go check it out. <laughs> Let's go check it out. Alright, let's go check the Master closet. closet. Master closet. Shoes. Oh so. look, it is so different. <laughs> Much different. It is than nothing just the wire like sewing. what it was before. Oh, nothing. awesome, awesome, awesome. So this is for all the long hanging. So right. originally you had that on this back wall. Yes, I did. But when really reconfiguring the space so that we could get all the shelving, it worked much better. Right. You know, putting it over here. Because you had more depth here. And initially it was just shelving, so the depth wasn't really utilized. It so wasn't. now you've got hanging here, double hanging there for short, you know, short hanging. And the nice hanging that will stay because the one before, if you recall, was being pulled out of the it wall. Was already. Because those little wire shelf things were just caving in. Exactly. Because they were not yeah, closet factory <laughs> type <laughs> material. They were exactly. Not These ones definitely material. not come off the wall. Right. <laughs> I know from having it before, I know that this is very sturdy. Yes. I love that. Definitely. So all the hanging on this wall and then we transition here. So come on in. Ooh, I look. like this. So look at all the cutties. Cutties. I love them. Exactly. So these are going to work perfectly because we designated this space for all of Joe's shoes. Maybe. And of course he Maybe. doesn't have it. <laughs> 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 it'll work Might perfectly. Be. Yeah, because his shoes are a little bit bigger than yours, but right. you know, his could fit all there, and then you've still got tons of space for the folded clothes. Right. Where the cubbies Lots are. Of that. And more, and an additional hanging space that we exactly. didn't have before. Before we only had two exactly. of that size of a hanging space. Mm -hmm. And then now we've got extra here and this shoes. whole thing. This, this was the thing. Remember yes. we were using the cardboard and oh, yeah, we, we were trying to make deep. sure it wasn't going to be too deep it's and we were trying to, exactly, and, and we wanted to make fit. it perfectly. Look at that. And you can get more. Look, mm -hmm. you can get, you've got one pair, two pairs, three, three pairs pair of shoes. shoes. Three pairs of shoes can go across there. Right. So you can fit 33 pairs of shoes. I can do that. Still there. They're just side by side. And I'm so glad that it, this width is not intrusive at all. Exactly. I feel like there's plenty of room for both of us in here. Exactly. 
And initially that was just a blank wall. So oh, it was yeah. a wasted space and totally you really couldn't wasted store space. anything up there. Totally wasted. And when we bought the condo, the closet door opened in. Mm. And we had them change it to open okay. out because I thought, as soon as I move in, I'm getting Closet Factory to come and fix this yeah. closet <laughs> because this is not going to work. And they yeah. gladly changed the change door for out. me. And look at this is what we got Perfect. because of that. Yeah. Excellent. Yay, well, we're so glad working with you guys on another time. I'm glad we got to see you yes. again, too. And it turned out just as great this time as it did last time. Good. Awesome. It's the end of a long day. Three different closets have been installed. The lovely pantry, which look at these awesome pull-out trays. And I have different sizes. It's incredible to me. So beautiful, such nice quality. This room, the laundry room, which matches my kitchen perfectly. And the bedroom, which I think we can now, in the master closet, fit all of our clothes in. So I can't wait to get all of this filled with things. It's been a long day, but three rooms or three closets were done in this day. And they got in here, they worked quietly, they worked neatly, they cleaned up after themselves. Juan did a great job, and I worked this time again with uh, Jacinta, who obviously did a great job designing because everything turned out perfectly just like I wanted, especially in the pantry, which I love so much. Um, it's just been a wonderful experience. Pleasant people to work with, always accommodating your needs and Closet Factory I just can't say enough good things about them. This is my second time using them and I have two more closets left <laughs> so when the time comes I'll be calling to get those two closets done but for now I can't wait to go put everything back into the closets and use these spaces they gave me. Thank you Closet Factory. Just got done with the job. All three spaces turned out extremely well. Jacinta was really happy with uh, the way it was designed. Uh, the client was extremely happy at the functionality of all her spaces. Uh, from what they moved into now and what they had before, they really had to consolidate a lot of stuff. So I think we did a really great job. Everything turned out really good. The help I had today with Cody was much appreciated. It was cool getting the shop guy out every once in a while, but they only work till 2.30. So, you know, they can't really hang with the big dogs. But, you know, the little puppies, you gotta get them out every now and then, let them run around. So. He did a really good job, and uh, I think we're ready for the next one.